Hey, good evening everyone. This is another session on palmistry and in this video we will be trying to time actually the different events in this particular uh, person's palm and we'll try to reverse map it. So I don't actually know what has happened uh, in this person's life at different life stages. So I'll be doing another video uh, on this same palm and, and tell you what the actual event was. And we'll try to see where we went wrong, where we hit the accuracy right and stuff like that. So we'll try to, you know, figure out few events and try to see from different lines and try to interpret that what might have happened at specific ages. That would be the larger attempt of this video. We will not pick up, of course, within a frame, you know, of time, we will not be able to cover up all the events, but we'll try to fix pick a few which are very very clear uh, to understand things right so that would be the larger uh, you know learning of this video again before starting with the video or with the analysis I would like to extend my gratitude to all the higher gurus Lord Shiva, Lord Shani, my friend Siddharth and all of you for always sort of finding something interesting out of my videos I hope it does help you and uh, you know uh, it helps you it guides you in whichever way possible and if you want to know more about your particular palm you can send it directly to me as well and i'll try to go through it uh, and and revert you with whatever my findings are now let's get started with this particular palm let's try to time different events so let us see the most striking feature of this particular palm so you can see that for example right one of the important features that i do see in this particular palm is this drop down line you can see this line dropping down right and this typically is happening roughly at or around the ages of you know 22 23 or so so around 23 or so roughly there might have been a, either a change in location or some other another energy loss again if you extend this line which is dropping down it's going parallel to the lifeline so this can indicate actually towards um, maybe some sort of a support but because the line is gets splitting it's like you know another new line is coming out of this palm this can indicate some loss of energy in some form so around 22 23 roughly we do see this event happening where there is some loss of energy. This can indi also indicate a change in location. It can also indicate probably a death of someone around this age roughly. Maybe someone close to him. Or it can also indicate that the person felt a bit demotivated around this age. Right around 22-23 or so. Let us see from the other lines. From the heart line we see nothing at all. The heart line looks smooth. Around 25, we can see an event, but at 23, nothing. Now, when we see from the headline, you know, this is around 20. Around 23, you can see some confusion coming in, right? You can see two lines interjecting. So, one is this line, which is trying to move up towards Saturn. And then you can see another horizontal bar, which is going towards the heart line. You can see a crisscrossing of two lines happening over here. So roughly around 22, 23, there is a possibility because at the same time, one line is going up, which in, and, and this line, by the way, which we learned that this line that starts moving towards the Saturn, because we can see that actually there is a line at the same point, which is going upward towards Saturn. So this can indicate that probably around 22, 23, a person might have faced depression, right? And that's where you can clearly see this line coming up. And you can see this loss of energy also happening in the person's palm, right? So around 23 or so, there is a fair possibility that there is a change in location, some demotivating situation, loss loss of health, or it can also indicate maybe a death of someone, any of such events which has also triggered a, some form of depression or a sudden event. Remember, whenever this line is going towards Saturn, it can indicate either towards an accident, either towards uh, depression, or it can indicate towards, uh, at times this can also indicate bone and tooth related issues as well, right? Because Saturn represents 
tax all of that so all of these situations are possible it doesn't seem to be some sort of a very strong emotional event as such because around 23 you don't actually see much activity on the heart line but on the headline definitely you saw that there are these criss crossing lines so of course the the mentality is affected let's see at the job line job line also you can see nothing so this can indicate that maybe this was some person or some unfortunate event it can be an accident because you know uh, accident is a sudden event it can be uh, a difficult or a tricky situation it can be loss of someone which has caused some form of depression uh, so yeah 23 looks to be a significant uh, age for this person and i'll come back to you what actually happened around 23 so that we can actually see where we went wrong or if we were right then what really happened around this age but my larger guess would be because it's going so strongly towards saturn largely a depressive state of mind and probably because of a change in location or because uh, maybe death of someone uh, or something or maybe a very sharp spiritual experience uh, that can also happen now let us pick up another such uh, uh, another important event now of course i would like to cover uh, maybe this square sort of symbol that is coming over here right you can clearly see this square shape uh, that is there let us try to see time what are the different things happening in this particular hand around the same uh, timing right so when the square is coming you can clearly see a square coming over here this is roughly from the uh, ages 19 till maybe 21 22 so 19 to 21 22 this is uh, square represents protection square also represents that though the person is moving fast but at the same time the person is very careful as well you know because square is a sign of progress but it also indicates slowing down at times because it protects you it does you don't have to go very sharp or very fast you need to be held you need to be stopped and the growth has to be slow and consistent that's what square represents now let us try to see what is happening in other lines around the similar age that is 19 to let's say 21 22 of course around 23 we do see that the person hits a difficult state of mind now 90 to 21 22 you can actually see another box like situation coming on his lifeline as well there are these vertical lines that are going up you can clearly see that right you can see these vertical lines coming up but you can also see these horizontal bars sort of cutting across which actually forms a sort of a square which indicate that though the person would have succeeded but still the person would have also you know faced certain obstacles square is always a sign where you are moving ahead yet you are facing some or the other obstacle nothing seen on the heart line so emotionally the person is fine nothing is happening on the uh, on the uh, fate line as well which means job wise also the person is fine uh, though we do see that roughly around 21 or so you can see a line going towards the mercury line which can indicate that probably around 19 till 20 21 the person's communication skills started improving the person maybe started speaking out you know so that's these are these again when you start speaking out healing begins square is also a sign of healing so this is uh, so two important events that we saw around 23 24 roughly we saw a rough patch in this person's palm uh, around 20 to 23 we see a square marking which indicates that the person was protected but of course right after the protection layer you see a difficult situation coming in right now let us see some other interesting event as well coming into the person's palm now roughly around the ages of 26 27 or so you can see this rising line stopping at the headline that means that a lot of positive effort being made but it's it's not getting him the results as he expects we also see a horizontal line coming across here so it's a mixed period again so roughly around 26 27 is an another important event where the though the person is very ambitious and is pushing very hard but the person also faces as uh, some sort of an obstacle 
Now around 26 on the job line we see nothing at all, no activity coming in. 26 is roughly around here. You can see a horizontal bar actually. This can indicate that maybe there were some obstacles around the job and that, that correlates to this horizontal bar. Again around 26 you can see this heart line going down uh, and also this line coming up. So this can indicate that 26, 27 can be a difficult period or a tricky period. Uh, the person might be very very ambitious that's a good thing that will keep the person going but the person will face emotional obstacles career related obstacles and also in general health related obstacles right now let us move to another signal so hopefully you got three important events in the particular palm right now let us try to see few more uh, one more event and then we'll wrap it up uh, another e important event that seems to be coming into the person's life is around this uh, around this age you know where you can see the lifeline completely sort of forming a new line and this is happening between 43 to 47 so this can indicate around 43 to 47 the person will go through a lot of transformations right now if i see on the headline i see nothing from 43 to 47 if I look into the job line, this is the job line. So around 43, 47 would be around this phase. So he might face certain obstacles with respect to job, but nothing major. The job line is able to survive. I don't see any significant change over here, but you see the heart line, you see the small islands coming in. So maybe the person around 43 to 47 will face certain emotional issues, certain emotional vulnerabilities because of which the person decides to change his life completely. So these are some of the predictions. Again, I will keep you posted on the same hand as to what really happened. Is the square signifying what it should? Is is are the you know the the events that we discussed around 23, this dropping down line, what happened actually around 23, 24, and uh, the different timings that we discussed. Right, so we majorly discussed about the timing around 23. Uh, we discussed about this uh, square between 19 to 23. We discussed about another important event around 26 or so. Right, so we I will keep you posted. Now let us quickly also see with respect to the health issues what we can see in this palm. With respect to health, what can you predict? You can see that the lifeline is not very smooth. You can see it's sort of changing its course so this can indicate spine related issues at times so one thing can be there that spine related issues or spine related problems can be there uh, what else you know looking in from the palm uh, you can also see that the person is emotionally very vulnerable and nervous so nervousness with respect to emotions can be there right uh, heart line it's there so it can also indicate that maybe blood pressure related issues can be there or maybe emotional ups and downs can happen in this person's life and the person is slightly emotionally vulnerable right that can be a minor health issue that can happen uh, the mount of moon also looks slightly developed and raised right and you can see the horizontal bars coming in this can indicate that there can be stomach related issues or digestion related or kidney related issues that are also possible so I'll also get back what the real health issues of this particular person were so that you are able to relate better, right? So hopefully you got few more insights from this palm. Feel free to predict what you feel will happen at different ages. Feel free to tell me that, you know, what you feel at different ages, uh, you know, what can happen in this particular person's life. And I'll let you know what actually happened uh, because, you know, um, um, I know a bit of history about this person. So yeah, hopefully you got few more insights. I'm Shitank into palmistry. Do check my channel for more. Thank you. Take care. Have a brilliant day. Bye-bye.